This trip I'm heading for Dalwini. Started at Fort William, through Glen Nevis, past Steel Falls, past a couple of boffies. I'll be in Dalwini by Tuesday. It's Sunday today, so it's uh, three days out here. First time here, just to see what see what it's like and uh, just to get out of the house basically. Something something to do. So that's morning. It's just after seven o'clock, uh, and I've got to get going. And I can't be bothered. It's raining outside, and it's windy, and I've got about twelve miles to go today. What to do, I can't be bothered making coffee because I'm I'm camped amongst heather, so I'm not going to be able to get the stove sitting properly. So. I'm just going to have the rest of these ginger nuts and then I'm going to make a move. Well, this is where we ended up last night. Just a few miles from Colera, I hope. Um, yep, so this is it. Not much here. I was hoping there might be a co op to get a drink, but there isn't, so. But we pack up now and then we'll get head off. Uh, and I'll have to turn off the camera for this one because uh, it's too windy to put the tripod out. And we're off. Off to Dolwini. 12 miles to go, possibly 13 miles. Should be there by 4 o'clock, hopefully. It's 8 o'clock now. So um, we're doing quite well this morning. Usually I'm away by 9 or 10. So we'll just keep going and going and going and hopefully we'll get there soon. Um, yeah, going by the map, this should be uh, Cairn Dirk, just up here. And Ben Alder, Ben Alder, which is also here on the map, uh, there. That should be behind me somewhere. So it should be up one of these holes behind me. Ben Older. Could be that one there, I'm not sure. Somebody come out, you want to help me out here. Um, yeah. So if you want to come and claim Ben Older, you would come up from Colra, which is where I'm going now, to Colra, where the Boffy used to be. So, yeah. Hi. Yes, to, to my surprise, it's actually turned out to be quite a nice morning. I thought it was going to be like really wet and rainy again. The clouds in front of me aren't looking too great to be honest, but well I'm not that bothered because I am well I'm getting the train for today anyway. <coughs> Just a should be a couple of miles from the old boffy now. The old colour of boffy, I don't know if it's still there. It's um, due to be demolished. Um, But if it's open, I'll have a look inside. I'll risk my health just for YouTube. How's that? And yeah, so we'll get on now. I get to the Winnie because I can't wait to get home for some pizza. Um, I always miss pizza when I'm out here. I always need pizza and some ice cream when I get home. And a nice big mug of coffee. Uh, everything else, all the home comforts that you miss out on out here. You know, it's good to get back. Well, I spot something there on the horizon. I wonder if that's the old boffy. Let's go and check it out. 
know. It uh, turns out that's actually uh, Calder Lodge up there. So it looks like the boffy is over here, over by the horses. He's coming to see me. Hello. How you doing, mister? Are you having a good day? Eh? Sun's shining bright, eh? Aye. Ma. So what are you up to today then? Just having a wee jog about? Eh? That's a grand morning. Good morning, Mike. Well, I'll carry on now, see your friends. Yep, so this is where I was supposed to be camping last night. I was supposed to make it here and I was going to camp outside. Obviously you don't want to sleep inside this boffy because it's, um, as you can see, it's got asbestos. So you could, um, it's dangerous to inhale that because you could die uh, from um, cancer or whatever. So, uh, yeah, so we'll see if it's open. Have a look. Have a look in this bit. Yep, it's lying open. Nice. So it's not too bad. It's um, still sort of um, it looks like a boffy really. But it's not supposed to come in. Not recommended. Uh, it's lying open, so there's no um, law against entering a, an open building uh, that I know of in Scotland. It does smell a bit funny though. I wonder if that's asbestos. Well, go round the other side, uh, see what the other side's like. Two other rooms here. Quite a big boffy. It's a shame it's came to this. So it's done a lot of work on it. Nice room here. Oh, this is a damn shame, like, such a shame this has got to be demolished. Great wee boffy, this one. Great wee fireplace there, stove. I suppose they could use a stove in another boffy, but yeah, and we'll check out the third room. And into the final room. Another nice room. I've got a sleeping mat in this one. Ah, this would have been a great place to stay. Someone's left some uh, meals. Um, tuna, chilli, pasta. Yuck. Um, yeah, so that's it. We basically need to get on. I might have a coffee and a boffy. Um, I haven't really got time for a coffee and a boffy this morning. So I'll show you a clip from an earlier time um, where I have a coffee and a boffy. Right, so uh, we're going to have a quick coffee at the boffy uh, before we get on. Out of Fort Augustus this morning, finish the walk and catch the bus finally, get home, safe and sound. Uh, I could still get attacked by a bear yet, there's still a chance, you know, it's still a few miles in the wild. But we shall we'll get there, I think I'll be alright. There's the balance that. Just gotta be careful when you do this that you don't scald yourself in the process. Be very careful, kids. Uh, you might want to get a parent to do this for you. Coffee at the boffy. Coffee at the boffy. Lovely. Lovely. Oh, it's too hot. Too hot. <coughs> 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 there it
10 miles to go now, we're on to it. Compass check here and make sure we're heading in the right direction. Should be going northeast, following that river line. So um, compass is it? yeah, looks like we're going the right way, northeast. So up that way, up this way. Yeah, up there you can see is the forest just ahead of me. I am in the right direction, heading for Dalwini. I've got about nine miles to go now, I think. So I'm quite chuffed about that. I'm looking forward to getting to the end and getting a nice got a nice bottle of coke or something guzzled down when I arrive. And it's uh, turned out to be a really nice day. So I'll be the very first day once I arrive at Dolwini. Well, passing through Ben Alder Lodge now through the skate and then down to the lock. The loch. Well that's uh, Ben Alder Lodge there, peeking out from behind the woods. It looks like a really great place to spend a few nights. Um, I suppose you've got to have quite a bit of money to stay there. Well maybe one day uh, maybe one day that'll be my boffy. So uh, here we are, we're at Loch Ericht. Loch Ericht, now, I don't know how it's pronounced, if it's Loch Ericht or Eric or what, but that's where we are now. So it's just a few miles along here now, along the beautiful Loch Derek. Lovely. Uh, so it looks like um, once we've reached the end of this Loch Derek, that's us at Dolwini. So it's all good, we're almost there. Uh, the page there. So that bit there, and then this bit here, and we've reached Dolwini. I can't wait. But it is a long lock, so it could be another four miles or something yet. At least it's turned out um, to be a decent decent day so far, so I don't mind a nice stroll along a beautiful lock on a lovely day. Uh, as long as there's pizza at the end of it, that suits me. The end is near. Almost there now. Well, that is it. I'm reaching the end of the lock. That's the dam over there. Uh, so that's the top of the lock, and the station should just be further on a little bit. Well, that's us here. We're in Dalwini, finally. Now we just need to find the station. Yeah, the Dalwini station. This is where the journey ends.
I just checked the board, I was hoping there would be an earlier train. There's no trains until 3.48. That is the actual time that my train's um, booked for, for my reservation for my seat number. But um, obviously it's an, uh, it's an any time ticket, so I could use it on any train today, but unfortunately there's no other train, so I've got to wait it's about uh, just under two hours to get the train. So I'm stuck here for a while now at Dalwini Station. Not lovely. Now, here. So, we're going to have a Choca Mocha teaser. Not had one of these in this trip, so this will keep me occupied until the train comes. One cappuccino. And one Malteser. Oh, lovely. Just like Grandma used to make. Oh dear, I think I put too much in it, can't stir it. Oh, tempted to have some. Noodles as well, still got a packet of noodles left in my rucksack. But I've no water left, I've just used the last of my water here, so I'm not going all the way down to the river just to get noodles. Hey, just to get water to have noodles when the train's coming soon. So that'll do me, that'll be enough, I think. Yeah. 